Hello my friends, welcome to a gateway with a view and thank you for joining me for episode 4 of Rides Through Time. Now we're on the witch today. I normally reserve the Rides Through Time series for the Classic 500 Ernie. But there's a reason I've brought this one along. Let's get on the road and I'll explain along the way. Now we're actually heading for a place called Trevevi Coit, which is up on the edge of Bodmin Moor. But I want to explore a little green lane that my mate Dave, that's Dave with a duh, has told me about, which runs from Kelly Bray near Callington. Kit Hill up there. So here we are in Kelly Bray. Okay, down here, so I think we'll set the cameras up. I'm actually feeling a little bit nervous because you never know what to expect. God, it's baking. Right, let's give this a shot. If I get stuck or if I have a kibble, it's Dave's fault. Oh no, bloody gateway. I should have bought Mrs. Saddlebags. <laughs> Let's hope there ain't too many of those. Nothing too demanding so far. Spend my time playing the game where every single day was a losing battle and every drink was a dead end. Eyes on the goal, don't lose control. I'm living fast, I've lost my soul, I'm driving to get away. Running through emotions, I am low. Oh dear, oh dear, can I get through there? I think I'll do a bit of a explore on foot. I think without knobblies, I'm just going to end up, end up in a mess down there. So, we'll head back, we did pass a little lane on the left which I think also comes out to a road so we'll go and try that one
Oh, there we go, there's a road. Awesome. Well, that's quite a view, isn't it? I don't know if you could see the mast up there, that's Carradon Hill. Now I think we're coming to a place called Lincoln Horn up here. Old phone box. These old buildings. Nice. Pub, what's that? Church House Inn. Never heard of that one. Just up here you see the views open up. Bit of a hazy day. And we're taking a right and going through a place called Crow's Nest. Some pretty in it. Here we are coming into Crow's Nest and we just go straight through the village and then we're pretty close. We are my friends. Trevevi Trevevi Koi. So let's park up and go and have a closer look. Known locally as the Giant's House, Trevevi Coit is thought to be a Neolithic burial chamber, which would have been erected around 5,000 years ago. It's likely to have been covered by a mound or cairn, leaving only the capstone visible. The capstone weighs roughly 20 tonnes. Apart from one of the standing stones having fallen into the chamber, it's remarkably well preserved and will probably still be here in another 5,000 years.
Neolithic burial chamber or ancient Lego. Who really knows? I hope you enjoyed our little trip out today. I have and I certainly had fun getting here. Thanks to you Dave. About time you got a bike and come out and join me. So as always, thank you very much for watching. And until next time, do take care. Ciao for now. Bye bye.